All right, in this video, I'm gonna ask Jesse a lot about the essential add-ons. You've already showed us the basic kayak stuff that you have to have, but what are some of the essential add-ons, some of the features that don't catch your eye right away, but still seem pretty relevant to have? Yeah, so I try to keep it simple, especially with my add-ons. Everybody has to have a cup holder. You know, you want, you drink, you eat on the boat. So that's good to have. A camera mount, GoPro mount is always good to have as well. Easy to clip onto the H rail, especially on the Hobies. Rod holder, the Scotty mount, clips right on just like these two accessories. And if you look inside the boat, I have six rod lockers that they come on the boat, but you also have the accessory that you can lay the rods down on so you don't have to damage the tips or anything like that. Another cool feature with the Hobie 360 is going to be the Mirage Drive system. The whole Mirage Drive turns 360 degrees with this lever right here. So if you're in a close quarter saying docks, mangroves, and you want to back up or you want to turn left or right, you can do it by just turning this knob and it makes life a lot easier to maneuver through those areas to chase your fish, whether it be a snook or a tarpon. Working my way up to the hatch, I have a battery in here that will actually power my LED lights or my depth finder. Now my depth finder I don't use a whole lot of in the area because I'm fishing the flats, but if I go up north and do a lot of bass fishing, I'll have that unit rigged up and ready to go so I can find rock ledges, trees, and stuff like that. The times I do use it here is if I go off the beach and I'm trying to find bait, especially looking for tarpon, I can use that as well. Last but not least, how to carry your baits and your, and your plastics and everything. This flambo box works really well. Um, I have a top compartment with, you know, some of the stuff that I use most of the time, packs of Z-Mans, jig heads, and then below I have a little bigger area. I can put my boxes, I can put my GoPro, uh, even some food or drinks in there as well. Also, another thing to have on the boat, if you're a tournament angler, is a measuring board. Now, you can make these at home. It's real easy. It's just PVC board. And you can get the 321 sticker so you can measure your fish so you know exactly how big the fish that you're catching, which everybody knows is the most important thing.